A whitefish woman turned her love of agriculture into a thriving composting business using some things that most would consider waste. MTN's Marin Sue has the story. This is the finished product of some 360 tons of composted food waste made here in Columbia Falls. I grew up and surrounded by, you know, all these mountains in Glacier National Park. I grew up in a rural at the end of the lake, not on the lake, but, you know, hanging out outside most of the time. Alyssa Lachance tells me her love of nature and sustainable agriculture started young. After getting a sustainable agriculture degree from the University of Montana, she turned her passion into a business. Lachance works with local businesses like Montana Coffee Traders and Glacier National Park, turning their food waste into this finished compost. But Lachance tells me composting is a careful science. The food waste is nitrogen, so that's only about 18 to 20 percent of our mix. The rest is carbon or else if you just put food waste into windrows, it will do nothing but rot. Materials like straw and leaves are added to help the waste break down. Kept in these wind rows, Lachance carefully checks each pile's temperature to ensure harmful bacteria doesn't grow. Rows are turned often to regulate the temperature. From start to finish, it takes three months to get completed compost, which is then sold back to places like local Flathead Gardens. If you're interested in getting involved, it's around $30 a month for a single family home to start composting with Dirt Rich. In Columbia Falls, I'm Marin Sioux. MTN News. LaShawn well, says that her next project is creating biodegradable bags to deliver her compost that aren't in those that aren't made of plastic.